to see you, bud. Buddy, good to see you. Good to see y'all. How are y'all doing? Africa, right? Come on. Come on. Come on. Uh, good to see the roots. Yeah, that's right. You the heard? roots right there. Come <laughs> on. Uh, season finale of Saturday Yeah, yeah, Live. yeah. yeah. It's, it's, a, it's a big show. Natasha Leone. I love you. Or White Whoopi, as I like to call her. You call <laughs> White Whoopi? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's you, got the gravelly. You ever heard her talk? She's yeah. Like, Oh, and she's very New York. And <laughs> yeah, that's she interesting. Like you think she's like Whoopi Goldberg? Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's a, uh, such a funny person. I know a giant fan of the show, so I think her hosting, she's like she's the best. Yeah, she's the best. It's gonna yeah. be fun. Yeah, it's yeah. gonna be a great show. Uh, th you've reached an incredible uh, stat that I read so, uh, recently. Is it uh, one thousand five hundred sketches that you've been in? Yes. Fifteen hundred. Fifteen hundred sketches. Fifteen. Honey, wow. Um, yeah, now, that, did, it seems like a lot. It's it is a lot, right? Oh, it definitely is a lot. Okay. I mean, but I mean, that's wild. Did you know going into the show that if you'd hit that mark, what? Only, only that day, like somebody posted, like Keenan Thompson's is only three sketches away from fifteen hundred. I was like, really? Like that's crazy. I missed all fourteen ninety. I wasn't counting. <laughs> yeah, no one was counting. Yeah, <laughs> but that's wild. But yeah, and then I, I saw that you know I had four sketches that day, and then at the dress rehearsal they were all in. So I was like, oh snap, I'm gonna like do this tonight basically. So I had that moment of like, that's pretty cool. And then after I did, I didn't think anybody was gonna be like waiting to celebrate it necessarily. Yeah, of course. But the, you know, our tender staff and crew were back there with like a card, and they were all clapping, and it, it was, that's, a, it that's was no? a nice moment. Nah, yeah, come man. on, buddy, that's nice great. Moment. I'm yeah. so happy. Uh, couldn't happen to a better guy. Do you know, know, do you know what to do now in a sketch? Like when when you have a line and it just bombs and it just gets no laughs. And I, I do now, kind of like that Whoopi joke earlier. <laughs> 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 I, I, just, I just laugh through it and, and go with it. But um, my first experience with that was was not great necessarily. It was yeah. a, like the first time. Do you remember it? Yeah, it was the first time a, a writer like wrote me a sketch where I was like a leading person, Ugh. and uh, it was called Randy the Bellhop, and uh, I was Hold like, your a, applause. you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> Relax. <laughs> do, do Randy, man. You know what I'm saying? Yo, yo do that Randy, man. We don't want to hear that big guy's <laughs> stuff. <laughs> so it's called Randy the Bellhop, and like you know, I was a, a bellhop doing shenanigans or whatever, checking in people. Anyway, yeah. I flubbed a line like really, really hard. Like I stumbled over it and I just let it be quiet. I was just like, I didn't try to fix it or anything. I didn't try to laugh through it or nothing. I didn't have the confidence to like course. continue. I just let the moment like hit the floor. And just froze? And it was very, very quiet. And I heard this one lady go, aw. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, that's You bad. know what I mean? Yeah. And like, aw. I, I, didn't, I didn't even react to that. Yeah. I was, like, I was so green, I was just Aww. like, yeah, this is not going well. I finished the sketch or whatever and, and they didn't write for me much after that. No, so it's and fine. You feel like you're letting them down, you know, when you're doing when the writer writes something for you. You're so honored that they wrote 1, for you. One thousand percent. I was so nervous, you know what I mean, and I was just shaky and blah blah blah. But now I just I, I really enjoy when things go off rail. Yeah, know? it's like, just a little different. It's kind of the best. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if something just sits there and just tanks, you just kind of go like. It is... pumps me up. Like I want to get crazy and like start running through the audience or something. And <laughs> it's like, oh, y'all don't y'all don't like that. What do you mean like this? Yeah. Yeah. Uh, can you can you clear something up here? Because I, I Samuel L. Jackson recently <laughs> said that you got him banned from SNL. Yeah, I, you know what he's talking I, about. I don't have the authority to do that. I don't know why he thinks that. Um, but no, I, this is a great story. And where which camera am I on? You can go to one. On the, hey Sam, <laughs> it's all good, bro. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah. You're welcome anytime, from what I've been hearing. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, he, yeah, he dropped the F-bomb on the show, but he says I was supposed to cut him off before that. But the cue card, it was just an F on the cue card. It wasn't like the whole word. Oh, yeah, no other letters. So I was thinking he was just going to go like a fake move and just stop at the F, you know what I mean? Of course, he what the Full train at it because, you know, I guess he's a exactly. method kind of guy. Exactly, yeah. <laughs> a method guy. So when he did it, the he did it twice. When he did it the first time, I was processing like, oh snap! Like he he did it, and I, I didn't make it or whatever. I didn't cut him off in time. You're lying. That just happened. I was like, okay, whatever. That was pretty cool. But yeah. you know, we kind of expect the F word out of Sam Jackson, so no yeah. harm done. Yeah. Every time but he's then, on, yeah, we're the, we know that that's probably gonna yeah. happen. Yeah. Then he doubled down and said it again. I was like, yo, my man, we gotta pay for those. You know what I'm <laughs>
<laughs> and it, it got a reaction. A lot of money, we were able yeah. To, like get out of the moment. But, <laughs> yeah, he was. He's been mad at me for that. So my, my bad, bro. You know what I'm no, saying? I didn't he, think he was gonna do it like that. But no, you know, no, he's he doesn't get mad. Come at on anybody. in whenever you want. It's, it's Sam Jackson. Sam Who doesn't Jackson, want Sam Jackson on. on the show? Yeah, you can come. You can host the Tonight Show if you want. Sam. Right. Yeah, come you heard on. It. Boy, we you love heard it. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, uh, I love your impressions. Uh, I, I like uh, David Ortiz, Big Poppy. Oh, he's the best. Uh, when you do that, I mean, yeah, I mean that, yeah. Do you? He's the best. You got to meet him. Uh, yeah, I love him. What, I mean, what does he think of the impression? Uh, you know, it was my chance to do like a Scarface impression. You know what I mean? When I heard that, you know, Big Poppy talk like that, I was like, oh my God, I can actually do it, man. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Take my Tony Montana moment. Ah, that would be a real right. thing. You know what I'm saying? That's a little how you bit. Do it. Talk about the Red Sox. Maybe <laughs> talk about talk about Miami a little bit. Yeah, uh, a little bit. <laughs> you know, and like he's just such a jolly person. It it allows for me to to have that fun like that. And yeah, I met him. I did his podcast, and he was like, "Yo, my man, I knew I made it when you was doing me on the show." <laughs> <laughs> I love that guy. <laughs> big lunch. He's the best, he man. A big lunch. I love that guy. Uh, yeah. I, I, I know uh, you just started this production company. Yes, And this shout is a out. big deal, but yeah, congratulations. Yeah, shout out to Artists for Artists. Thank you very much. But this yeah. is like, this is, the, this is the chapter. This is what you dream of. I feel like this is the next stage in life, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So I, I partnered with my buddy, uh, Johnny Ryan, and um, we, we started this thing where it's going to allow for uh, lots of things to come under it. And uh, It's called Artists you know, for Artists? Artists for Artists, because uh, we believe in artists being able to have some ownership kind of in what they do, you know what I mean? So yeah. even if it has to come out of our portion or our proceeds, we want to make sure that, you know, anybody that does a movie should be able to get the percentage of that movie for as long as it's out, you know what I mean? Not just being paid to show up and do the work. Like, you should have participation as it goes along. Like, imagine if you had participation in, in Beetlejuice. Like, just take that, for example, like a 40-year-old idea or whatever. Yeah. And you have a percentage of that, that's way better than just getting whatever check they gave him in 1988. You know what I'm exactly, saying? Yeah, so, right. That's kind of uh, the strategy of it. But also, it's going to be the mothership. You know what I mean? It's going to allow for a lot of other you're things. You're doing documentaries. You're and all doing that. The... Docs, movies, a lot of stuff that I don't necessarily have to be at yeah. to happen. Yeah. But you're doing a live thing, too. What's, what are you doing with Mike Tyson? Yeah, we have, um, you know, a live element, too, you know, because we're big Broadway fans, me and my partner. And, you know, we're fans of everything first, kind of. So we're launching with uh, Tyson coming back to the stage with Undisputed Truth 2. Um, you know, he did his one-man show um, back in the day. I think Spike was directing it. Yeah. And, uh, this is part two, so we're, we're starting with that and, you, and other stuff you, like how'd that. How'd you meet Mike? I met Mike. Uh, he did a What's Up With That back in the day, actually, and he was... Oh, uh, did he really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. He was very funny. Like, he got up and, like, you know, turned around and, like, shook his butt in the camera yeah, and stuff yeah, like yeah. that. Uh, all the stuff couldn't happen to a better guy. Congrats Thank on the, you, the season finale of SNL. Keenan Thompson right here. Thank ladies you, man. The one and only. This is the finale of Saturday Night Live is this weekend with host Natasha Leone and musical guest Japanese Breakfast. Hey, hey.